Good morning, dear students. Welcome to all of you to today's alternative English class. Before starting the class, let's do Brahmanath. Oh. Santi Santi Open your eyes. Now let's start today's class. Today in this class we are going to read a poem. So dear students now let's read the poem. Poem is Dog's Death written by John of Dyke. And John of Dyke is belonging to America. And here the person the poet has taken birth in the year 1932. Let me tell you something. Here this poem is written on the memory of his pet. Okay, pet might be dog, might be cat, might be something else. If you are keeping tiger as Sarasra Chaudhary had kept tiger as the domesticated animal. So, but here it is referring to only cat or dog. Understood it? Here it is mentioned that John Abdai in this poem, the poem is very really appealing as well as it is universal poem. Because in this poem, he has mentioned clearly how much he was in love with his pet. And what else is written here? Look. Poem is dog's death. Dog. The most lovable pet animal. So many of you are having the dog as the pet. And here, think once. You are having a pet animal. And the pet will die one day. Can you tolerate? Definitely it is very difficult for you to bear the pain. And here the poet has mentioned dog's death. So definitely his pet dog has died here. So why do people keep pets? Either for fun or they do love pet animals. That is why they are keeping the pets. And here one thing is also mentioned. People are also keeping pet for different purpose also. If they are keeping cow, buffalo, it's a goat, okay, they are keeping it for milk, for flesh also, as well as they will work in their agriculture land also. But here we are also keeping the dog because it watches our house as well as the dog is the most faithful friend of a human being. That's why we normally keep dog in our houses. And so now let's read the poem. Let's see what is written. C must have been kicked on scene or breast by a car. It means what has happened to the dog is clearly mentioned in the very first line of the poem because the title is dog's death. It means definitely the dog died. C the female dog must have been kicked. It means the poet is speaking that C must have been kicked by someone or kicked on sin means by mistake sin might be kicked by someone or it might be possible that brushed by a car means it might have collided against a car means by mistake she came across a car she was hit by the car it is mentioned by the poet understood two things might have happened first one is she must have been kicked on sin or must have been brushed by a car two things might have happened to the dog too young and the dog was too young it was a baby dog puppy not puppy or actually too young dog to know much she was be beginning to learn and here what is the poet speaking the poet is speaking that the dog was too long it means the dog was not at all an experienced one the dog was quite young and the dog was learning a number of other things to know how she was, no much she was beginning to learn. In the meantime, the dog was getting regular training. The dog was just beginning to learn. So definitely it was a baby dog. Okay, because it was not an experienced one. The dog was not having almost all the knowledge. To use the newspaper spread on the kitchen floor. So what was the dog learning? The dog was learning to use newspaper. Okay, so... Here one thing is mentioned the dog was too young and the dog was learning how to use the newspaper which was there in the kitchen floor 
and for the what purpose the dog was learning to spread the newspaper to urinate there to excrete there the dog was learning to spread the newspaper and to do on it and to win waiting there the words good dog good dog here it is repeated two times why because the poet is speaking that the dog was learning it it means the dog was not making the complete house dirty the dog was not really urinating in each and every place the dog was doing it on the newspaper and the dog was learning it and everyone out of love and affection all is speaking that the dog is a good dog good dog means the dog was quite good one according to the family members because it is mentioned in to win waiting that the words good dog good dog it is not only being spoken by the poet but also spoken by all other family members we thought we okay means not only the poet wife of the poet or other family members we thought her sigh malai sigh malai means what bodily discomfort which was not seen also i have written the meanings on that side okay you can write it down so here it is mentioned we thought her sigh malai was a short reaction short reaction means what terrible reaction okay fearful reaction then when the means the dog was also showing some symptoms the dog was also reacting differently and the poet did realize that the short the sigh malai means the bodily discomfort was an unpleasant thing it was a terrible thing for the dog the autopsy autopsy disclosed a rupture in her liver then here look the dog died then the medical examination of her body was done and from that it became clear that there was a rupture means crack okay there is a crack in her liver means the dog was having injury in its liver that's why the dog was feeling discomfort so and by the autopsy only it was disclosed that there was a rupture there was a crack in her liver and we teased her with play blood was filling her skin and the poet is speaking that we mean see along with the other family members with we, we teased her with play means the dog was not spayed the dog was means even when the dog was not feeling good still the dog was made fun of everyone means all are making fun with the dog they were just sometimes what are we doing small kids what are they doing if they are having a pet dog they will just pull the tail they will just hold the ear we normally do all these things with a pet animal so likewise they were playing with the dog they were teasing the dog blood was filling her skin but the dog was unable to speak like human being the dog was also feeling uncomfortable the dog was also feeling terrible and what was the condition blood was filling her skin means blood was filling in each and every part of its body that's why the dog was unable to move the dog was unable to react properly because it was feeling bodily discomfort and her heart was longing to lie down for ever so you have hear what is mentioned her heart was longing to lie down for ever it means and her heart was longing to lie down for ever means to die okay and here the poet has mentioned that they were playing with the dog but the dog was not at all feeling good it was unable to move properly but still the dog was not at all reacting the dog was very good and when they were teasing the dog the dog's body his its heart her heart was longing to lie down for ever means she was preparing to die because there was a rupture in her liver at the same time the dog was not at all feeling good because blood was filling in her skin that's why she was longing to die but it was not known to the poet as well as to the family members all these things are disclosed disclosed after the body means after post mortem okay so after the autopsy it was disclosed that there was a rupture in her liver so here the poet has mentioned that even when they were teasing the dog still the dog was not at all reacting the dog was having control on herself so she was learning all the good manners and her heart was learning to lie down 
forever. Understood? This one is your stanza 1 and stanza 2. So now see stanza 3. Here what is written in the previous stanza I have told you one thing and what is that? That is the poet's dog died. It was a female dog but we should not call it bitch. It is dog only. Okay. So here remember one thing and the poet was expecting something wrong has taken place on the part of the dog but after the examination of the body it came to light that there was a rapture in the liver that's why the dog died. Monday morning as the children were now on that side I have written the word meanings if some other word meanings you are unable to understand you just call me and ask okay no issue. Monday morning as the children were noisily fed Monday morning it was a school time so what happened the children the kids are being fed and as you know the small kids they will create too much noise so they were noisily fed and they were sent to school and sent to school she crawled crawl means what creep okay means it is not walking to walk by using hands as well as legs and it was too slow movement the dog was doing it crawled beneath the youngest bed means the dog crawled beneath the bed of the youngest child of the house. Okay. We found her twisted and when the poet did find it, it was twisted means it was completely bent and limp and it was also limping. It was unable to walk properly but still alive. But still the dog was alive. Understood it? So on Monday morning what was the significant thing? The kids were fed noisily then they were sent to the school. But the poet did notice that the dog was crawling and it was limping but still the dog was alive. It means the dog was also struggling for life. The dog also wanted to leave but something else was also written in the car. So finally the listen the poet was an ardent lover of the dog. That's why he has mentioned so beautifully on the dog. In the car to the vets on my lab she tried then the dog was taken to the veterinary doctor to the doctor and what happened the dog was sitting on the lap of the poet and the dog tried to bite my hand and the dog tried to just bite the poet's hand and died and what happened the dog was just trying to bite the poet's hand and while trying the dog died understood i stroked her worm stroke means what to strike means to do like this to pat okay i also written moved okay here move means the movement means you are stroking my hand means you are doing the movement and the poet also stroked her worm hair and the fur means the upper skin upper hair of the dog is known as the fur and that one was quite worn and my wife called in a voice imperious. Imperious means what? The way of giving orders with tears and the wife, the poet's wife was also terrible. She also was unable to understand what to do because the dog died. She also, there was tear in her eyes but still she was speaking something. Those surrounded by the love that would have upheld her and they were expecting that they were having too much love and affection for the dog. That's why the dog will not leave. Sometimes what are we speaking? If we have too much love and affection for someone or some of the family members of ours, we are thinking that they will be with us forever. But this is not true. Likewise, in the case of the dog, the poet as well as all the family members, they were having lots of love and affection for the dog and they were thinking that their love and affection can save the dog. But it didn't happen. Though surrounded by the love that would have, that would have often heard, they were thinking that the dog will remain alive because they were having too much love and affection for the dog. Nevertheless, he sank. But in spite of all the love and affection, the dog sank. The dog died. And stiffening, then the body became hard. Disappeared. Disappeared means what? They were unable to see the dog. It means only the mortal body was remaining there. The dog was not at all alive. Understood? Understood this stanza? Stanza number 4 this one is okay. Back home we found 
that in the night her frame here her frame is referring to the structure of the dog okay the body of the dog back home and when they return home we found they found that in the night means the previous night the body drawing near to dissolution and they found that at home when they return they found that the dog was suffering from diarrhea in the previous night had endured the same but the dog was unable to bear the same the dog was also ashamed of it and the dog doesn't want to make the floor dirty the dog doesn't want to spill stool each and every place so of diarrhea and had dragged across the floor and the dog was dragged across the floor drag means the dog was unable to move properly but still the dog was strolling and the dog was moving and then what is mentioned that dragged across the floor and the dog was moving across the floor listen here it is mentioned okay that the dog was going to die the dog was suffering from diarrhea but still the dog was unable to bear the shame and what was the dog doing drawing her near to dissolution had endured the same and it is mentioned that the dog was unable to bear the same that's why the dog was crawling on the floor and crawling by crawling what did the dog do to a newspaper carelessly left there and where was the dog do going the dog was going on the newspaper to excrete okay and the dog made the newspaper wet instead of making the floor dirty understood it that's why finally the poet has spoken good dog okay here what is mentioned look they were taking the dog to the vet on the way the dog died they were unable to save the dog but when they returned home they noticed that the previous night the dog was suffering from diarrhea and her body was going to mingle her body was going to collapse but still the dog was conscious of her responsibilities as the dog was getting training and the dog just strolled on newspaper to spill the stool there to excrete there and it is also mentioned that finally even when in the dying breath also the dog didn't wish to make the floor dirty that's why the dog was finally speaking good dog it means the dog was quite a good one okay so the complete poem is on a dog and the dog was means very lovable to the poet and how did the dog die and what had happened what is the reaction of the poet is clearly mentioned in this poem okay you just read the poem try to understand it if you have any doubt you can call me otherwise you also can ask me in your this class okay thank you have a nice time